Hello. This is an SN2 reaction mechanism. Note that the molecule is in solution at all times. Here is shown the movement of a pair of electrons from the nucleophile, the hydroxide ion, to the central carbon atom. This forms a transition state complex, shown here. Here, we show the movement of electrons again. Please ignore the disappearing H2O molecules. Note that the electrons move from the hydroxide to the carbon, and subsequently to the bromine, since the central atom is slightly positive. This attracts the electrons, and they later move to the bromine because it is more electronegative than carbon. Now we notice that a bond is being broken between the bromine and carbon, and a bond is being made between the nucleophile and the carbon atom. Note also that this transition phase has a very high activation energy requirement. These are the end products, and we can see that the bromine is now a negative anion. Hello Kitty, thanks you for watching. Have a good day.